Hi guys, if you want to release a new update for any app in the Play Store, you of course have to provide some information about your new version. In my example here of our new game, our new release of Christmas is coming, I have to provide a um, lot of languages. Already have an in here German and English, but still some others missing. So what I'm gonna do already prepared some information in English and now here comes a magic trick. Late point I want an fant.com. So I go on our website translate.iwantanelephant.com. I have a small service here that I can use to create all the other languages I need. So I enter my text for 2017. What has changed? New version, better gameplay and some things more. Uh, my input language is English, that's fine, so I click next and now I can say, whoa, a lot of languages are here and ah uh, yes, I need all of them. So I select all and now I click on translate. What's happening now, you can see it on the top, we are creating 66 translations. Why only 66? Because English is already there and we won't translate it again. So waiting, waiting, waiting takes some time, some round trips to the server of course and preparing my translation but you can already imagine it's just quicker doing it that way than doing it manually with Google Translate or by hand if you are able to speak those languages of course you can go this way as well. So here's my result. I have a large list now so perhaps I want to see my result in what am I able to see here say in Japanese. I'm not able to speak Japanese but there seems to be some Japanese in there. I'm able to speak German so uh, I might change something here. I'd like to have my game named in German Christmas is coming as well. The rest looks nice. So, the other things looking good. If there are any errors, so the, um, the character limit is reached, um, it would be shown in here, but everything looks good. So next um, is, um, I can see my result, of course. Well, many things in there. I'm good with that as well. Uh, close. I copy my result to the clipboard. There is it. And now I go back to the Google Play Console. I remove everything that is in here, paste my results, click on save and we see everything is provided. Your change have been saved and I can publish now my app. That's it. You can find the service on translate.iwantanelephant.com free to use, no login required. Just give it a try and ask for feedback. Thank you guys. Bye bye.